Jacksonville homeowner who shot and killed a man in his yard Saturday night says that man was his estranged son-in-law. Today, he shared with us what led him to pull the trigger. WYFF's News 4's Ashley Swan is here with this News 4 exclusive. Carol John Hughes says his daughter and son-in-law were in the middle of a contentious divorce, but he had no idea, he says, late Saturday night. That's who he was shooting at. Everybody that I love was in this house. My whole family was in this house. And I did not know what was happening. John Hughes says fear. I could see someone at the window, partially in and out. Is what prompted him to shoot a man outside his Simpsonville home late Saturday night. And I said, stop. And the movement toward me got faster, and I started firing again until the body went down. What Hughes didn't know until police arrived a few minutes later was the man he shot, who now lay dead in his yard, was his daughter's estranged husband, 51 year old John Michael Farrell. How did that happen? How did that really happen? According to Hughes, Farrell and his 32 year old daughter had a troubled relationship that began when his daughter was still underage. Two young children, and Hughes says many police calls later, his daughter was trying to get herself and her kids away. Despite a restraining order, Hughes says Farrell showed up at the house Saturday night promising no trouble, but quickly got into a verbal altercation with the family. The last time I saw him was when he left the house, and the next time I saw him, he was in the yard. Regardless of their history, Hughes says he and his family, especially his daughter, are distraught. I killed my son in law. That's horrible enough. But the fact that I have to somehow tell my grandchildren that I killed their father, that might be more than I can take. Simpsonville police tell us they are actively investigating this case. Of course, stay with WYFF News 4 for any and all developments. Michael. Ashley, thank you.